Today is an easy recipe. We're making oven baked chicken thighs. When you hear the words thighs, you think of unhealthy dark meat, fats, and clogged arteries. We're going to turn these chicken thighs into a healthy dish. Start off by cleaning the chicken. Sprinkle some salt over the top of your thighs. Then pour in your apple cider vinegar. Fill the bowl up with cold water, just enough to cover the chicken. Give the meat a quick rinse in cold water to remove blood and loose meat particles, such as feathers or scales on the outside of the chicken. With your shears, start to remove any excess fat and skin from the thighs. Depending on how much you love the skin will determine if it's removed. But keep in mind, the skin contains a lot of fat and calories. In my opinion, thighs are the hardest part to clean on a chicken because they contain a lot of fat. No matter how much fat you remove from the chicken, it still seems like there's a lot more fat to go. Cut the skin back and remove that slimy texture that's underneath the skin. Slice a lemon in half and squeeze the juice on top of the chicken. Continue cleaning until all the thighs have been cleaned with the lemon juice. Time to combine our dry seasonings. 
first we have smoked paprika. Creole seasoning. Adobo seasoning. Old Bay. Accent. Chicken bouillon. And oregano. Give all of these ingredients a quick mix. Next, grab a white onion. You're going to slice this onion. It doesn't have to be perfect, but after you finish slicing it, set it to the side. Place your thighs on a clean work surface. With a paper towel, pat the thighs dry. You want to try and remove all of the moisture from your chicken. Grease the bottom of your baking pan to prevent your chicken from sticking to the bottom. In a baking pan, place in your chicken thighs. Add one teaspoon of vegetable oil. Rub the oil on top of each thigh. The oil will help the skin turn crispy. Start applying the dry seasoning mixture. You want to make sure the dry seasoning touches every part of the chicken. Flip the chicken over and continue applying your seasoning.
underneath the skin of the chicken should have seasoning as well. At this time, you want to preheat your oven on 375 degrees Fahrenheit. This next step is optional. You can add in your sliced onions. The onions will add more flavor to the chicken thighs. Next, I'm going to pour in one tablespoon of apple cider vinegar to help enhance the flavor along with the onions. Place your chicken thighs in the oven for about 30 to 40 minutes depending on how hot your oven gets. I've taken my chicken thighs out of the oven. I'm going to baste them with the juices at the bottom of the pan. I'm going to put them back in the oven on broil for five more minutes. And that's how you make oven baked chicken thighs. If you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the notification bell and share my channel with everybody in your contacts. Bye.